The Jigawa state government says it is putting modalities in place in the state's education sector in order to dismantle barriers and create expansive opportunities for the development of women. Governor Omar Namadi disclosed this during the inauguration of various projects at senior girls' secondary schools in Jigawa. Here's that report. Free education for girls from primary to university levels along with free meals, enhanced school infrastructure and adequate teaching materials has transformed girl-child education in Jigawa State. These efforts, according to the governor who spoke at the Girls Science Secondary School, Jahun, are aimed at empowering women to reach their potential. Your Excellency, we are especially thankful for the recent renovation of our dining hall. The transformation is remarkable and it has made a significant difference in our daily lives. The renovation has provided us with clean, comfortable and enjoyable environment to have our meals. Your Excellency, we are also grateful for increasing the quality and quantity of our meals. The food is not only nutritious, but also delicious. Governor Namadi said the notion that when you educate a woman, you educate a society, reinforces his commitment to equal educational opportunities for both women and men in the state. Uh, it is quite important to congratulate the education family in the Gao State today. <laughs> because today is their own day. We have just finished launching or commissioning the renovated Unity Second Girl Secondary School in Malamaduri, which was renovated by Zenis Bank. And now here in Japan launching the distribution of 30,000 set of school uniform to our girl students. This shows that the education ministries are up and doing. So congratulations the education family. The governor inaugurated a computer laboratory, dining halls, school fence, and a distribution of 30,000 sets of school uniforms at Girls Unity Secondary School, Malam Maduri, and Girls Science Secondary School, Jahun.